Hello all, welcome to another video of Components 101. In this video, I'll show you how the divide by 8 counter IC, which is the CD4022 works. So we have already covered a similar IC, which is a DK counter IC, which is called 4017. And the difference between that is a DK counter IC can count from 1 to 10, while a divide by 8 counter IC literally counts from 1 to 8. So let's take a look at the CD4017 as I told which I have covered earlier. So in, if we scroll down to the simulation, you can see 8 digitally controlled outputs for uh, based on the clock pulse given to pin number 14. So both of these IGs are exactly the same except that it is counting from 1 to 10 and 4022 counts from 1 to 8. So as you can see, we also have an enable pin and a reset pin and it works very similar to the 4022. So let's go ahead and continue the simulation of this thing. Just give me a second. So I have started the simulation and you can notice that the LED is getting incremented from 1 to 7 for every 1 second. Why is it getting incremented for every 1 second? It's because the frequency of the clock pulse that I am giving to pin number 14 is 1 hertz. So as we know T is equal to 1 by F so it's getting incremented for every 1 second and the enable pin here can be used to pause the increment. For example, for example, the count is currently at Q3 and I have made the enable pin high so it stays there as long as the pin is held high. When I make it zero again, it resumes with its counting. And the reset pin, as the name suggests, whenever the reset pin goes high, the complete counting is resetted. For example, now the complete count is resetted and it is held at Q0 unless it's made zero again. So this is how the enable pin and the reset pin works now the carry out pin is a bit of an interesting pin so this is used to cascade with other 4022 ic's if you want to count to more than eight or you can use it with logic gates since the ic supports ttl you can use it with other logic gates or flip flops or whatever your application demands it to be so as you can see for the first four outputs the carry pin stays high and for the second four outputs the carry pin stays low and if you look at it you can notice that for every eight clock pulses that you give to pin number 14 you get one clock pulse on the c out pin so this is why it's called a divide by eight counter ic and normally you can use it with other 4022 if you want to count more than eight as i said earlier one peculiar thing about this I see is that it's normally used with microcontrollers since it has 8 bits, 8 bit microcontrollers since the IC also comes from 0 to 8, it kind of syncs in with your application when you're trying to do 8 bit incremental counting. So uh, that's it guys, this is how the IC works, hope you understood the tutorial, thanks for watching.